All right, well, here we go. Okay. okay. <laughs> I can't believe this is happening. This shouldn't be happening, but here we go. We got a dancing and and stuff, and then the big old rare, rare blue and gold. Uh, Dolby surround. Uh, I I don't know if that will survive the recording process. Oh, we got some marks on around. All right, well, there we go. This is the window. You, you can know the words. We can join in. Too. Man, I know the song, even though I've never really played it. Okay, hi. hey there, everyone. By the way, in case you didn't realize. This is Ow Cow, and in case you didn't realize, we're gonna be playing Donkey Kong 64. You know, the has gonna last forever, and uh, Sonic Heroes has been lasting forever, and it's gonna be followed by a game that lasts forever. So might as well play a third game that's gonna last forever. The Treaty Greens, the all game. I'm joining modernity here, and look at that. We saw the all that what Hong Kong 3 was about, shooting down bees, except, you know, instead of letting the bees eat a human. Whoa, look at that, they did a camera thing. That small child is so strong. The style got style. There's a dog that's gonna eat her. Oh, but then she can become smaller, which, you know, makes it easier to beat up this, this animal. I don't get it. Here on Sarah, play Hong Kong 64. All right, let's set up expectations. Technically speaking, I play this game a little bit, doodling around. She's one cool Kong. You know she's cool, because the game has to go out of its way to tell us. Whoa! Style, he breaks the TV. He also doesn't have any money. Uh, yeah, so like, I doodled, like, a, a cousin of mine, once upon a time, like, rented it. So I doodled around in it without doing much, other than playing... Donkey Kong, basically, at some point. However, I do, I feel like I know kind of a bit, huh? Because, uh, just cultural nerd osmosis on the internet. Like, this game is infamous as heck. Oh, wow, wow. Didi's so laid in. And they added some electric guitar because he's so cool jumping on his tail like that. There's his upbeat. Yeah, man. There's a Super Smash, Final Smash, or whoa! It's so cool. He's got a guitar that's gonna impale his armpit. We're gonna rock a dial in TNT. Yeah, that's right. Just murder on a rap video here. That you know it's not special effects. The last member of the DK crew. There's a slight. I don't know. Oh, that just happened. I mean, that looked pretty easy without any sort of relativeness there, singer. Whoa, spoilers! Oh my god, bananas! So yeah, I don't know a whole lot about this game. There's some pretty sweet little sprite layering effect there. Fall in the blade! Whoa, camera tricks! Pine. What do? What they do? Maybe you should throw them out if they if they have a weird smell. I don't know. Not telling you how to live there. There's a big guy, there's Clum, he's got a grenade, everyone dies! And that's how I played Donkey Kong Country 64, live on DKTV. I pressed start and it took a while for the game to notice. So yeah, I don't know what I'm getting myself into. Every, every time people know I'm gonna play this game, people are like, are you gonna like 100% it? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe? No, I don't want to play widescreen. Well, I'm not. I, I'm. I'm set. Or I'm set. Story skip. Um. High score. Chimpy cam. Don't know what that means. All right. Well, that was fun. That was the. Yeah, that's adventure. Mystery. Can't select that. Kong battle. Sounds like multiplayer. Sounds like multiplayer. Got monkey smash and battle arena. Here got sound. You know, it's a headphone. Whoa, it's blue. Stereo. See, I don't got like Dolby surround sound. Only stereo. All right. Well, let's go on an adventure. I've got the emptiness and a raciness. All right. Let's go north. Uh, so Donkey Kong and his four metal states and no percents, no time, no bananas. Then a zipper happens. We're gonna unzip the Kong. All right. We've got a story here. Look at that bird. Oh, is that why I got weird borders? Because it's set on... Widescreen? 
maybe it's just a story there. All these squawks. Squawks has other squawks. Oh, they're setting the mood. Uh, it's a big mountain. And now it's a big parrot. I mean, it's a pretty doughy parrot. Look at that. Big, this is an N64 game. There's, hey, it's Clapper. He still exists. Okay, alright. That's exciting. There's not a whole lot going on in that island. It is extremely bare. Hey, it's Donkey Kong Island! It has significantly shrank since the last time it came to- Oh, okay, there's just... There's just seals in general. Look at that guy swimming backward. What a professional. Here we got, you know, we got the Shivers and the Timbers. Uh, finally, on this day and age. We got some sweet camera panning. Alright, that's exciting. Oh, is that Krem Island? I remember that from... K rules smash final smash. I guess I got spoiled there. It's gonna throw a laser directly at Donkey Kong Island's face and blow it up. Oh, wow, that generates a lot of power, all things considered. Like this is oddly efficient. All things, all things, you know, put into places. So many polygons in your hand. It's incredible. And you're breathing like Vader? So that's what they're going for. I've been waiting a long time for this moment. Oh, he has a voice. Donkey Kong and his pretty little island. And he doesn't have no more. subtext, subtitles. Alright, well, getting excited about Donkey Kong and his island. Alright. Everyone wears a belt, but no pants. You know, having a belt with no pants just accentuates the fact. Like, it makes you look more naked. Oh, there's some high-tech engineering there. <laughs> what is going on? Alright, well, Hatricia is trying to steer the island here. Alright, fair enough. That just looks awkward as all get out. Oh, you're gonna wash your island ashore. Well... I guess that stops that impeding invasion. That's pretty nice. An engine stalled. You just you don't want that to happen. Like right there on your invasion attempt. Like that's just embarrassing. Like you're just gonna call off and like wait it out a couple of months. Hope they forget. That is does the tiny island move or did the big island move? I can't. Okay, it's just the camera's just kind of going wild. There's a floating island I just saw. Like, what is happening? Are they flirting? Are the islands flirt like the, the 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 natural island, the artificial one? They're just gonna start dating. I don't know. I don't know anything. Oh, there's an earthquake, and there's some. Ground textures. It's pretty sweet. Oh, they're so wacky. I want you to do everything in your power to keep Donkey Kong distracted. Steal that horde of golden bananas he treasures. He has so like much, and take care of these pathetic friends. This time there can be no mistakes. He has like just like tiles of all. Oh, your excellency. We've already taken care of business. <laughs> I mean, they're just staying there. I hope for your sake you're right this time. This is really goofy. While you'll be busy looking for your precious golden bananas, feed them friends. I mean, why don't you just, uh, ooh, that's my impressive. Like, I don't get it. Just, if you can get all his buddies, just get Donkey, idiot. I mean, yeah, he can do one-handed uh, handstands, one-handed push-ups, it's pretty hard. Alright, uh, Squawks is here with the news! DK, DK, come query, rock on! Oh no, uh, that just advanced on its own. I did not press any buttons. That's the speed you're supposed to read that. This banana, like, peel right on the floor. Alright, here we go! You can jump. I can flap. I can duck with this button. Alright. Yeah, I don't know the controls at all. So that's the equivalent of C up, I think. Alright. Okay, if you run, you do a really weird kick. Oh, it takes a while to get out. And D-pad doesn't seem to do anything. Can I interact with you? 
No. Okay, you got air punch with your hands to get huge. If I pause, these are my options. Alright. Uh, that tree's moving weird. No, it's just my hammock. Can I hammock? This is it. This is how you enjoy a hammock. Alright. Well, this is starting. Um, let's see what's going on. This is DK's house. He put a possessive on it. <laughs> I don't know why. That's kind of awkward. Uh, yeah, we're just playing Zelda here. Well, Squawk, your precious banana horde and all the other Kongs are dead. You can't find them anywhere, Donkey Kong. Uh, why? I don't want to tell him. He's just going to make fun of me. I got a melon! I did it! You can climb a tree! I did it. Game mastered. Okay, you do get a little bit of distance by doing that. There's a cave there. There's a... There's a sign. Can I... Okay, I can change the camera thusly. Way out is here, I guess. Well, let's look around. Like, is there anything to find around in this little area? Then suddenly there's a giant camera icon in the corner to welcome us to the modern age all right that's always a good sign oh there's cranky he lives there on this patch of grass okay when you get close his giant barrel lab rises from the ground donkey is like just melons away from just eating some of that potions there it looks like a Wait, my flea bitten friends be! You don't know, do you? I'm a. Donkey wouldn't know. The parrot just screamed at him. Luckily for you, old Cranky's batch of home. Oh, we're gonna get powered up by moonshine, huh? That's weird, but okay. Create three dimensions! Completed my training barrels. Uh, alright. Sounds like something we're gonna be doing. Oh, look at that. There's just, just barrels everywhere now with Cranky's face on them. Awkward zooming on Donkey's face. Uh, oh, and he speaks and thinks like a caveman. Well, that's just fancy. Okay, so maybe you have a long jump? Maybe. There's uh, an elephant in the song. There's water here. Eh. But I can't... Okay. It's not a continuous camera turn. You have to, like, hit it, and then it... So that's the way out, right? Training area. All right, let's go and do that and learn about the game. Here we go. Jump in the barrel. That happens. You get a screen transition. You gotta get a DK coin. All right. Squawk. Press A to leap from one vine to another, and R when holding a vine to face the other way. Is it to drop from a vine? I'm gonna collect coin and the vines work. When I got a minute to do that. All right, here we go. I'm climbing a tree. That vine is attached to nothing. Uh, I don't know why I jumped backwards there, but okay. uh. oh boy. All right, <laughs> this is what we're doing. We're inside the barrel! I get it. Kinda. Dude! Okay. The- like, I'm gonna get the hang of it, eventually, I'm sure. Eh. Touch that vine, alright. So, okay, so, doesn't look like you need to manually swing. Yeah, cause pressing up or down makes Donkey climb up or down. All right, did it! I got rewarded, and the guy, the guy from Clay Fighter 63 and a third, shouted at me that I did well, and then the barrel explodes. All right, now that's what I call training with the masses, with the molasses. All right, what are we going to learn about today? Squawk. All right, going to learn about that. Pick up a barrel, press again to throw it. Uh, throw barrels. I did it! I picked up that barrel and I chucked it. Whoa, I can't believe I'm allowed to be so uh, violent. Not just allowed, but encouraged. Video games! Uh, I did it. I have done well. These barrel ain't seen the last of it. My melon health is dancing. That one's glowing purple, but I'm doing this one instead. 
Uh, we've got pulsating oranges here. <laughs> Pick up the orange, press Z, duck, and then side to throw? What a- w okay. Wow, this is kind of a precursor and- well, no, it was released after... After Banjo-Kazooie, huh? You can kind of tell because this is like some weird control combination. So you can throw grenades, apparently, by ducking and camera right. <laughs> Naturally! That's what I call a very, very, very natural sounding situation of love. And here we got water! You can swim in this game! Press it drive to swim, zelt to water break, and get down. Got it. So, okay, so, yeah, so Z is to break once you're here, then I'm like, eh. Like, really, my enemy here is a camera. There you go. Okay, I could turn it there a little bit. Ooh. Your, uh, hit detection is actually pretty precise. Like, I feel like I got, like, right next to- oh, boy. So is this a better swim style? Well, you undulate like a real fish. So, strictly speaking, in terms of economy of movement, in order to create movement underwater, it would be better? Dad! I just scored all the barrels, and you're like carrying your own little thought bubble. Alright, let's get some Cranky's Moonshine! That's the only reason everyone tolerates him. Alright, so, turn the camera like that. Oh, hey, I got a get the camera centered right on DK's butt button. Alright, glad I found you. And you don't do anything yet. But there's an army of butterflies going after me. Ooh, flashing colors. Flashing light here. I do apologize for that. Oh, what? Well, okay, so like the text just goes. Uh, Simeon Slam. But is. Oh, I got I got Butt Slam. Finally. Well, we drank the right minimum amount, and here we go. Oh, and everyone learns how to Butt Slam when I'm the one that drinks the soda. Alright. You need to unlock this very basic move. Okay, well, only if you bring me 15 banana medals. Alright, so there you go. That's a banana medal. That's how you unlock Cranky's Moonshine. <laughs> Did it! It's a butt slam and it creates a big, like, wave. I can't believe truly we have unlocked the potential of all living beings. Anything in this water? Like, why is that there? Whoa. Okay, so you can hang on to ledges. I don't know how- okay, so you need to press up to pull yourself up, if you just... If I want to let go, I can't? Yeah, I tried to let go there and it did not let me. I want to go in the water a little bit. Okay, see? So you press Z to go into underwater mode and then you can go down here and get all these grenades. There you go. I've got a face full of grenade. There we go. Ooh, I just had 20 anyways, it looks like. Somehow, eh, this is really uncomfortable. All right, changing swim style. All right, this is a bit, yeah, I cannot go above 20. All right, fair enough. I don't seem to have an air meter. You know, gorillas are known for being aquatic. I press start now. Okay, so see, the universe gets blurry and you can see 20, 20 bouncing oranges. All right, I understand. Whoop, get behind, get behind Donkey Kong camera. Your running speed isn't the best, and there's giant weather spiders. Whoops, press the wrong button. Whoop, I misaimed. No, yeah, woo, woo, ah, okay. I mean, this controls pretty all right. It controls like I would think Donkey Kong Country would control in 3D. Apparently, the autosave is like ridiculously generous, like, it autosaves after everything you ever do. I don't know, it's just over there. It must be the one. Oh. That makes sense. Realm of the only one that has been blocked off is that island with a cave on it! What are you talking about? I- oh! That little place, it has a one right in front of it. That's mysterious. I mean, I've been playing for- oh, what's that? Okay, I'm gonna stand and press to banana port between the two. And explicitly banana port. I don't know what that flying barrel up there means, it's probably nothing. 
let's activate the banana port there and then I guess that's where we're gonna stop like we haven't even started a game but no yeah uh, kind of took a while to get going but we did have the whole fascinating story you know to go through All right, I did it and look at that I'm gonna banana port so you go here do you pound it how do you activate it how do you activate the banana port um oh okay you just duck on it and yeah you know get zip what else do you need and you can press okay. save okay. and he says okay there you go instant okay button basically the best game ever made right there